Hello everyone and welcome back to Metal Gear Rising Revengeance and I watched some Onichan ga Oshimai so now let's play Deki ga Oshimai which means there won't be any enemies So, so, so. You have almost reached World Marshal Headquarters. Hmm. I guess I have to fight. Okay, I'll try. Okay, I'll do this. Hey. <laughs> Come on, how tough are you? How tough are you? Cardboard box. Destroyed, let's go. And execute. Enough. Perfect cinematic execution. Combat rank A. No. Oh. Avoid fighting if I can. How? Um, two. How do I use this? Um... Let's see. Okay. I need to hold C. Whoops. Ah, fuck this shit. Let's destroy them. I don't care for them. Raiden may care, but I do not. It's my first time playing the set of game anyways. I am more skilled at slaying my enemies. Bullseye. Oh. Ha <laughs> 
I get a good look at this guy. Combat log. Oh, he got recoil. Completely fucked up <laughs> because camera was directed at the wall. <laughs> That's why it looked fucked up. Rocket launcher. A payback for the car that you destroyed for. Taste of Denver. Oh, as I expected. Chests that I forgot about. Oh, these roadblocks are literally mobile. I see. How cool is that? Ooh, endurance plus one, let's go. 140 HP. I feel like... Wait, this literally feels like near Automata. Amusement park, let's go. A uh, chest. Another chest. Sold cheap, medium. I don't care. Bullseye! This is my style of fighting. Rip and tear! That's what I know Metal Gear Rising Revenge and Store. <laughs> Literally rip and tear. Oh. Another blade wolves. How do I slay this bit? Gonna fight this guy. This guy literally is immortal. Look at this. I can't hit him at all. Come on, come on. How should I hit him? Come on! Tell me, how should I hit him? The only thing that I can do is basically walk up to him and Sandatsu. Otherwise, 
I can't do anything. Stop moving, otherwise you are immortal. Give me your juice, bitch. Hundred percent destroyed. Combat rank B because of the dog. Head to World Marshal HQ. Hello, Sam. Yep, that's true. Sam is right about this. Sam is right about this. Totally right. I fully agree with him. Um. Why do I see him everywhere now? Ah, uh, he is hacking around me. Just to look at me. Yep. <laughs> adults, they made their choice. Sure. Exactly. Sure, they signed up for this. Right on the dotted line of their PMC contract. Usually, they're no strangers to war. In fact, many times they already lost a limb. Yep. Many times they were out of work and starving on the streets. So, yes, they signed up for surgery to fight God knows where. How else would you provide for your family? When your country's embroiled in civil war, pain receptors shut down, pumped full of fear inhibiting nano machines and sent right into the blender, your blender. But they made their choice, right? Open your eye and see, Raiden. One eye? Plenty. Then listen. Those battlefield emotions that the nano suppress, listen to them. What are you talking about? Shh. Sam is messing with him. Is something the matter, Raiden? Right 
Oh boy. If I won't but defend myself, I will die instead of them. But rank A. You can destroy with me emotions. I am already immune. I thought they had a choice. A fair choice. Not like you. They didn't have a fair choice. But they had a choice. to my own name. And your taste buds a mile high. That advert in the background. I guess I cannot fight for now. ZXCV ASDF UWERP FG Where is the box? I'm spamming the buttons right now. Hmm. I'll try to hide as much as I can. He can't even zon that at this point. Best I can do is let lead him to safety. I wonder if uh, walking around the corner will be safe for me somehow. I don't think it will. However, I think I found the breakthrough. 
through which I can walk. Or no. He didn't attack? Oh, he did attack. I just am too slow to move. He became way clunkier. Come on, move, bitch, get out the way, bitch. Can I beat them like this? I am literally thrashing around. You can't even fight her anymore. Hello, Sam. Oh, illusionist. My name is Monsoon of the Winds of Destruction. The windy guy. I guessed as much. Hmm. Is this a monsoon boss fight? <laughs> nope. There is some, so it is cutscene only. Monsoon comes later. Feasting on the insides of your enemies? How easily you ignore the loss of life when it suits your convenience. So tell me. Who saves the weak from the man who saves the weak? You're the ones exploiting them. You take advantage of their weakness. Of course they get hurt when you set them up as your human shield. Oh, bravo, Raiden. You be killed, Jack. Phnom Penh taught me that. Phnom Penh. Error. Memes. Checkpoint. That is until the illusion was broken. Don't 
Don't be ashamed. It's only nature running its course. You have no choices to make, nothing to answer for. You can die with a clear conscience. Uh -huh. About me, I mean. I knew something was off. After the Patriots, I thought I could walk off the battlefield uh -huh. and into a normal life. But here I am, surrounded by death, arguing philosophy with terrorists. I told myself this was about justice, about protecting the weak. But I was wrong. <laughs> then you admit it. I learned young that killing your enemies felt good, really good. In America, my friends, my family, uh -huh. they helped me forget the devil inside. But who am I kidding? I was born to kill! <sighs> so the bit about my sword, that means of justice stuff, I guess I needed something to keep the Ripper in check when I was knee-deep in bodies. You? But you, all this, is a wake-up call to what I, really <laughs> what I really am. What are you saying? I'm saying Jack is back. <laughs> Now this is what I call anger. <laughs> Nice aura. This is my normal, my nature. You've lost your mind. <laughs> nice voice acting. Double kill. Triple kill. Monson was fight. Just being nasty. <laughs> that nickname you love so much. Wanna know how I got it? Actually, <laughs> I'm gonna give you a demonstration. I like this. Time for Jack. The letter rip. Rip and tear. Monson boss fight start.
I see. This is the throwing time. Where are you here? Three grenades. Here you are. Let's go. His dodging ability. I somehow recover. How can I slay him? No Zandatsu fight. <laughs> this is fun. Time for the slaying this again. This is his dodging phase. Huh. Let's go! <laughs> Much more to do! Lawrence Force? Oh, I think I should dodge this instead! Lawrence for Scott. Welcome back, Monsoon. I think I need to fight him.
However, he still stays at 40% HP. Now I am at 40% HP. Have a Pernano Pace equipped, good. Rapper Nano Pace? Yes, Rapper Nano Pace. Dodging time. <laughs> This is fun, even though I time 11 HP. <sighs> he will dodge several times. Twelve percent HP. Eleven. Ten percent HP. He summons the spinning blade. Angle spinning blade attack. Zing. It exploded. Somewhere. FC full. This time it hit me. How do I get hit even though it doesn't do anything? Monsoon. His telekinesis power is strong. Checkpoint, last phase. Full control. Ah, uh, star. I get it. I get why there was a checkpoint. I was supposed to send that so. That Japanese sign was a Zandatsu. I clicked the X. This cutscene thingy is pretty hard. Zandatsu is second.
Bullseye. Finally, only two tries. Combat rank D for these nuts. It was hard, but doable. And here, I passed one to you. Reaper mode tutorial is now playable via VR missions. Ryden? Yeah. I'm fine, Kevin. Relax. I'll get the brains. I don't want this for anyone else. All right, man. Thank you everyone for watching! Tactical side dystopia unlocked. Combat rank C, D minus A, B minus Asa minus S Baba minus. Yes, customize. Of course, fuel cells. And life. As it should be. Unique weapon. Full arm sai. A side dagger powered by Lawrence Force. Following Fleming's left hand rule for motors. This force is generated by a magnetic field created by the user's cyborg body. And the electrical current flowing through the sky. Developed after careful analysis of Monson's battle data. Main weapon upgrades. X for enhancements. Strength. Let's go. Absorption plus plus three. Energy plus two. And I guess that's all. And that is the checkpoint. Thank you everyone for watching. Hope you had a fantastic time. I will now end the episode. Okay, so hope you had fantastic time watching this episode. Bye-bye.